We are currently on question 44. Question 44 says find the value of the determinant containing the element 0, 3, 2, 1, 7, 8, 0, 5, 4. This is not actually a matrix. This is actually a determinant. And it has a value which we are to find the value of. Now in finding the determinant of a matrix, in this instance we have a 3 by 3 matrix. So when we ask to find the value, we need to recognize something. We need to recognize the way of finding the determinant of a matrix. We basically have a determinant matrix which is more like a scalar matrix. So how do we go about this? We write out the terms given to us. We write out the terms given to us. Writing out the terms given to us, we we'll have zero, three, two, one, seven, eight, zero, five, four. Now, before solving the questions, we insert place signs on the matrix: plus, minus, plus. So this then becomes now. We now do what we call, we now write out, we now create minor matrices from each of the matrices. So from the matrix we have here, I'm going to have 0, which is more like going to multiply every term in a new matrix I'm going to create. Now all the terms on the same row as 0 will be removed. Can you see what I'm doing? All the terms on the same row as 0, that means 0, 3, 2 would be a new matrix I'm going to create. And all these terms on the same column as 0, that will be 0, 1, 0 would not be also in the new matrix I want to create. So the matrix I'm going to create is just going to contain 7, 8, 5, 4. So I'll have 7, 8, 5, 4. Now, because the place sign of 0 is positive, I just have positive 0. Now, the next sign I have is a negative place sign. That will be minus. Now, what's the element I have here? 3. So I'll have 3. Now I'm going to create a new matrix involving 3. I'm going to remove all the elements that are on the same row as 3, 0, 3, 2, this th particular 3 you are looking at, and all the elements on the same column as 3, that will be 3, 7, 5, will be removed. So when I remove all that, what would I have left? I would have 1, 0, 8, 4. So I would have 1, 0, 8, 4. Now plus... 2. All the elements on the same row as 2 will be removed. So when all the elements on the same row as 2 are removed, 0, 3, 2 are removed, 8 and 4 are also removed, 2, 8, 4 are also removed. So the minor matrix I'm going to have is going to be 1, 7, 0, 5. So from here, what do we have? We notice that 0 multiplied by anything would give us 0. So I would have 0 minus... Now I'm going to find the determinant of this 2 by 2 matrix. So I'll have 0 minus 3. Now taking the determinant of this 2 by 2 matrix, the diagonal elements will be multiplied to each other. So I would have 1 times 4. I'm sure you can see what we did. 1 times 4. So I would have 1 times 4 minus 0 times 8, 0 times 8, plus 2 into bracket. Now, 1 times 5, minus 0 times 7, close bracket. So this gives me 0, minus 3 into bracket. 1 times 4, that will give me 4. Now I have 0 times 8, that will give me 0, so I just have 4 left plus 2 into bracket 1 times 5 that will give me 5 0 times 7 will give me 0 so uh, that's what I will have I will have 0 minus 3 into bracket 4 plus 2 into bracket 5 that will become 0 minus 12 plus 10 rearranging the equation this becomes 10 minus 12 and 10 minus 12 is the same as minus 2 scanning through the options that corresponds with option B did you enjoy the video? Get a prep class tutor today. Call 080-59-811-502 or 90